Welcome back. It also would not be a Thursday without Tate from Wildcat Brothers. Welcome back. Oh, welcome back, Taylor. It is going to be a good week, well, except it's for the weather. Week. Well, yeah. But you know, this okay. weekend is going to be great. It's going to be great. With Big weekend for you guys. It is. We're we're doing our grand opening at Gator Cove, so we're pretty excited about that. So uh, yeah, all you guys come out to uh, Wildcat Brothers at Gator Cove tonight. We uh, actually tonight we have. Uh, Mariah and her dance video launch and yeah. Mariah and Chubby's going to be there and then tomorrow we have our official ribbon cutting. Yeah, and we'll be there, be there live. The show is going to be on the road. Absolutely. And to kick off your festival weekend, what are you making? We want to do something a little different. So MVO is one of our, our kind of our higher end ROMs and it's, it's, it's aged like bourbon. So it's actually okay. going to be in a fresh brand new uh, charred oak barrel, okay. which not many rum people do. And, and you know, it's, it's best served, you know, over a big cube of ice. With the fancy ice. The fancy ice. But what people don't realize is that, you know, even with fancy cocktails, you can actually, you know, you can actually make cocktails with it. Yeah. Uh, we want you to, we want people to drink what they like to drink. So last night we had a friend at the bar, Lexi, who's actually at Luna. She, she's bar manager at Luna. She helped create this drink. Okay. And we call it the Ginny. And it's actually because it tastes like a gin cocktail. Um, and it's, I love it's, this. I know. So it's, it's, it's not going to be, most people think of rum as being sweet drinks. Well, yeah. you know, with the Ginny, it's going to be, this is a little more on the, on the, again, the floral side. So what we do, we're going to do three parts of our MVO. Okay. Now this is making three drinks. Adam's not here because of the severe weather stuff, but again, realize that you want to go in parts. We're going to go three parts of our MVO, one part of our rosemary simple syrup. Remember okay. this is equal sugar, equal water, and throw some rosemary in there. We're going to do one part of our lime juice. What's the rule? Has to be one ingredient. One ingredient, boo boo. That's I it. I panicked. This was a pop quiz. I wasn't ready oh, for. Oh, look. I mean, hey, we're <laughs> we're, we're right there. Uh, so one ingredient here. We're gonna throw in some orange bitters. Oh. Uh, if you want to really booze it up at the house, you could actually use Cointreau. Cointreau is a, an what orange is liqueur. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then our little favorite ginger ginger drops. Remember, this is the one rather than using like ginger beer. Yeah. We're gonna throw in some ginger drops in there. So typically, if you're making this by yourself. You want to do one one drop, mm -hmm. or actually about four drops for one drink. Okay. But we're doing bulk. So then we take it. Oh, wow. We kind of splashed. <laughs> we're in the live, splash zone. Live over TV, here. people. Uh, <laughs> so what we're doing is we're going to shake it up a little bit. And since you are our the garnish, garnish queen, girl. yes. I got this. Okay. We're going to take it, put it into the glasses. And these are the fancy glasses the for fancy a fancy glasses. drink. Fancy glasses, absolutely. So. Um, and, and again, why this is, we, we, we call this, it's, it's very gin, gin like because it's not going to be overtly sweet. It's going to be very botanical because we have the ginger in there. And also the, the orange, orange bitters. bitters. Absolutely. Uh, and, and the lime juice. So when people drink this, they're, they're thinking about it as being, you know, this is going to be like another daiquiri. No, this is going to be a very. I'm excited because gin gin's drink. one of my favorite drinks. Gin so. will make you sin, so watch out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. See, it's not, it's not overly sweet. No, but and it's you really. Very botanical. You kind of don't realize that it is rum. Yeah, yeah. And that's the thing is, is, look, we live in the Napa Valley of sugarcane here in Acadiana, the best sugarcane in the world. And we want to be able to make stuff that is, well, we make our rum, but we also yeah. are able to age it and flavor it certain ways that can fit any kind of, any kind of taste. So, yeah, uh, yeah this is with our, our dark rum. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's probably one of my new favorites. This is one of my new favorites. And Tate, if people at home want to go check you guys out, what's that address? We're at Gator Cove, 2601 Southeast Evangeline Thruway. Go visit them. Have a great time. Absolutely. We'll be right back after this. Hey, really fast. Where are you guys located? So we can come and visit you guys this weekend. 2601 Southeast Evangeline Thruway. We have a ribbon cutting tomorrow night, uh, tomorrow during the day. And then on Saturday, we have music beginning at noon all the way till late. So food trucks, music, and Go great visit room. them. It's going to be a great time. And our next half hour is also going to be a great time. Chubby is here. Carly with Festival International is here. Stay with us. We'll be right back after this.